Hi, Gene Titchwell from Action Lending here with this Air Piracy Game Bobblehead Doll. Today's question is, how does the decline of 806,000 in the workforce increase economic growth? See the video we have for you today to see how. The jobs report today was good on the surface. 288,000 new jobs were created in April. One-third were in retail. The unemployment rate dropped from 6.3%. Wonderful news. Not. The reason for the drop was that 806,000 people left the workforce, dropping the labor participation rate to 62.8%. Jimmy Carter era numbers. If the labor participation rate had stayed the same, the unemployment rate would have gone up. The number of new workers coming into the workforce was the lowest since November of 2008. Rates were better at the end of the week, mainly due to the geopolitical concerns in Ukraine, overriding any kind of good economic news that was out there. Mortgage-backed securities were up 50 basis points for the week after going up 58 basis points the prior week. U.S. Treasury was down 8 basis points and closed to 2.58, below 2.60 for the first time in a long time. We have a video today for you of one of the people who left the workforce, so he's spending his time feeding his hamster tiny burritos. Forward this on to your friends. Subscribe for free down below. Any questions about real estate or mortgage, give me a call or send me an email. Take care.